you have been waiting for. Finally, it is my official room tour. Yay! This is probably my most requested video of the moment. There are only a few things that I want to say beforehand. I live in an older house, so some things, even though how much you renovate, can still look, you know, like an old house. But I think we improved it way better than when I first moved in. Um, I do have a smaller room because my older room tours, I had big rooms and lots of space. So now I have a substantially smaller room. I still want to do more renovations, but this is basically what I'm at right now. And I don't know if I will do any more, but I am comfortable and happy with how my room is now. We spent a lot of time doing it, paint changes. It just went through a whirlwind. It's nothing dramatic or special, but this is my room and here is the tour. Thank you for watching. Alrighty, so this is the outside of the door. I'm going to try to hold this as steady as possible. I'm sorry though, but let's just go in here. My nice dogal door handle. This is what you first see when you look at my room. So let's enter. Give you guys a nice spin first. Basically, this is a panning spin of my room. Do, 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 do. And like that. All right, let's go into detail. So, there's nothing special back here. My door is just basically white. And this is my closet section. The closet is basically the only thing that I am wanting to do more renovations on, but I don't know if I will. I did a lot of renovations. I might post like a renovation like before and after, but basically it looks a lot better than what it did. The only thing is there was like really disgusting doors here. So I took these off and I wanted to just put like baseboard here to cover that and just make it a little bit better. But that's like the only thing I did not do. So that is what it looks like now. I have some beautiful like uh, floral damask print paper there that I got at Target. And I have a little furry bones. I had two, I honestly don't even know where the other one went. He's not like hiding back there. I look, I don't know. But it was like a blue elephant one. It was so adorable, he gone. And that's the only thing that I store up there. Sometimes I will put the clothes I'm gonna wear for the day up there as well, but there's nothing right now. Here's a big overview of my closet. I wanted to keep it an open concept. So first of all, I have every single one of my dresses hanging up here on all these like different colored hangers and yeah I just do it from yellow to white these drawer storages things right here are my favorite things ever they save so much space time get them at Walmart I think they're around $20 I have all different colors of them this one here is basically just only bikinis um, the middle one right there I think has zip up sweaters but all the rest is a bikini this one actually all of these are all sweaters yes I am obsessed with sweaters I have so many of them and that is like cardigans um zip up sweaters pullover hoodies bunny hugs whatever you call it wherever you're from that's what those are so it's basically just sweaters from here to here that is all t-shirts yes i have a lot of clothes and i go through them quite often to figure out what i don't wear anymore back here all this right here some rompers i don't have many but basically shorts and skirts over here are pretty much all my hats i have a few laying around like downstairs and such but that's all my snapbacks and fitted hats right here are um pullover sweaters that i just put right there because i didn't fit there is blazers not all of them though jerseys are right there and back there i believe that is blazers as well that was my closet nice and colorful and open this is my dresser and my dresser is from Pier 1 and it's the Hayworth collection. I have a lot of things from the Hayworth collection that you will see in here, but also in my makeup collection, which I will leave the link for that down below because it is the exact same still. This is a gorgeous dresser and I love the look of it, but let's go, actually let's do what's in here first. So this is bras, underwear, socks, PJs, sweatpants, sweatpants. This one here is workout stuff, jeans, and pants. I have two picture frames. The picture frames I got at HomeSense and I have a signed Justin Bieber picture here and a signed Jacob and Bella picture from Twilight. So Taylor Lautner and Kristen Stewart. I love those so much. They look so cute and the designs of the picture frames really match my dresser. I have a little chrome Hello Kitty mirror right here that I use for decoration. I also have the custom engraved pink sparkles mirror like this. Nina gave this to me. 
It is absolutely gorgeous and stunning that looks like that and I love to just display this on my dresser. This is a plate that I got at Value Village for 99 cents and I keep a lot of samples that I get from Sephora mainly um, or if you guys send me some samples I'll just throw them in here and if I want to try out a little perfume I can just spray it and go or if I'm wanting to try something new this is my sample place because I love just having and trying out new makeup. Next I have my Hello Kitty again chrome brush set that looks like this. Nina also gave this to me. I have been in love with this. I don't use it at all because I love just like looking at it. It is like perfection and adorable. Back there I have a Yankee candle in, I don't even know. Santa's pipe. Okay, this little stand right here, I also got at HomeSense because it matched my room. I have a glittery pair of handcuffs that I use for decoration because they are adorable. They like give a little edgy feel to my room. Hey girl, this little donut is a piggy bank. I thought it would be amazing to have as a decoration. I got that at Forever 21, actually, I think. I think it was Forever 21. Anyway, this pink sparkle glitz out pen also for decoration. I got this for Christmas from my mom. I have two headstones from Super Mario brothers I have one from Goomba and the other from dry bones they are so funny and clever and we got these in a convention in our city I have a random candle here a Kringle candle I don't even know why this is from Claire's I just love how that looks and I bought it for decoration over here I have a Queen of Hearts it looks and appears like a book but it's actually um, to store things in I don't know what yet so I just set it up to display it um, I got this like carousel pony ride type thing. I got this at Value Village. I think it's gorgeous and pastel. A Juicy Couture button. This little um, ice cream cone guy that I got in my peel box. I just thought was way too adorable. A cupcake. This was actually a picture frame. I cut or like it, you could display pictures on it. I cut that off and just had it as a cute little cupcake for a decoration. Two lipstick pens. I got these both in my P.O. box from separate people at separate times, so that is amazing. I have a little Barbie compact also in my P.O. box that I just leave right there. This picture that says, time to drink champagne and dance on the table, pink sparkles from Nina, love you girl. Another random little candle there that I've never lit before. And then over here, I have a picture in Vegas at the Caesars Palace. Oh my God, my dad's blocked out, that's mean. There we go, this is us at the Caesars Palace in Vegas at the Bacantal Buffet, and I never know if I'm saying that right, but it is amazing there, and I thought this was a great picture and a great memory to display. Okay, so over here to these two little guys here, I'm gonna go over these quite quickly. I just have a bunch of hair products that I have. I love trying out different things for my hair, but my favorites really are um, Label M and Argan Oil. Then I have all my cell phone cases right here. If you wanna watch my cell phone case collection and going through that, that link will be down below as well. This little drawer thing, I got this at Ikea. And what I have in here, I will go through just quickly. The first drawer, so this is all basically like hair and cell phones, but I have bigger clips there. Um, clips if you wanna clip your hair back, like that. Hair ties, tinier little tiny elastics, bobby pins, fancier bobby pins, combs. I always seem to lose mine, so I only have a few there right now. And um, fancier um, hair ties that have like designs and stuff on them. Next, we have a bunch of head wraps because you guys know I am obsessed and honestly just throwing them all in here works so great for me. I can just find them easy. Next is again head wraps. Like look how many head wraps I see and have and wear and love. Like so many girl. A bunch of hair extensions, wigs. Those are wigs back there. Extensions, extensions, extensions. Just like tons of different extensions and I write the names on there in case I forget which ones they are. And the last drawer down here is hot tools. So I have my um, blow dryer, curler, crimper, straightener, interchangeable wands for my cortex, which is not in there and the other ones aren't in there. That's my life. This is the fail part, but that is okay. I have this little cute um, jewelry box, Hello Kitty. I keep like random things in there. Used to be in my makeup collection. I bought it on eBay for around $200 or something like that. And it is horrible. As you can see, the drawers are open because a lot of the drawers don't even close um like this one it is like now locked shut oh oh there we go but then now this one won't open yeah if you get one open that's great but you won't get now this one open this one stays open but it doesn't close this one won't even open at all but basically 
really? How did I get these in there, you say? They just opened fine. And then as soon as I went to close them all, they didn't work. So I need a different way to store my bows. But here is all my bows. The top here, I have tons of different sections for cute little clips and or bows. I don't even know if this is gonna open. Oh, this is open. Bows, randomly, I'm obsessed with bows. Oh yes, this opened. Look at how many bows. Bows for days, my friends. And this is the one that doesn't open, but if you can see at the side here, there's a ton of bigger bows in here and there's like layers upon layers. This one won't open as well. And there's just bows in there. This one here are flowers and cute little things to put on your hair. Will this one open? Uh, kind of. This is like uh, bigger head wraps and uh, floral crowns. Oh, and the very last one is headbands. Back here is something you guys probably have all been waiting for. This is my perfume, body spray, and lotions collection. And I will be doing a video going in depth on everything and going through my entire collection. So stay tuned for that because I know that I'm going to get questions and have got questions. But yes that will be coming in the future let's just give you guys a close-up so this is the first section display case right here yes i have a ton but this is all of them that i have right there next we are going to do my bed that looks like this i love my bed this room is so small so i'm gonna try to back up i'm like legitimately in my closet now but here is my bed so beautiful i love my bed my bed is from ashley's furniture my mattress is from yisk and so are those two stands those are from yisk as well i had a red and black bedding as you guys know if you have been watching my videos for a while that bedding failed me and ripped so i got this bedding here which is slight zebra it's not too in your face so i really like that because i can sometimes be like way too dramatic and have dramatic things but this bedding that's just zebra and the two zebra pillowcases are from Walmart, believe it or not, and it is so comfy and cozy. Like, it is so soft and comfy, and it's amazing to sleep on. Um, and these three red pillows are from that red and black set that I had, so those are Yisk. This little throw is also from Yisk as well. Um, the two pillows back there, because we don't sleep with any of these. Uh, these pillows in here are from Yisk, and they're way too soft, like way too soft. So we sleep on these ones here. They are such firm pillows. We got these from HomeSense. HomeSense, they're so firm and amazing. And these pillowcases are Ralph Lauren pillowcases, if you're wondering. So soft, honestly. Then we have one of my favorite parts of the room, and that is this wallpaper. It's not done perfectly, but I love it. Like, this is exactly what I wanted. It's a damask background um, where we sleep, and it's just amazing. Like, I love that. My boyfriend did it, and I love him. I got the wallpaper at Home Depot, actually. So let's move on to the last part in my room. Oh my goodness. And that is this little bedside table. This bedside table is also from the Hayworth Collection from Pier 1. It is so cute and amazing. First off is this old school phone that, no, it's not hooked up, but it definitely can be. There is a wire here. You can hook it up and actually talk on this phone, no problem. Um, but yeah, it looks like this. It can work beautifully. I love it. Am so in love. It is gorgeous, classy, wonderful, sassy, and I loves it. Like it is, oh my gosh, this is probably one of my favorite things in my room. It is so cute. This little genie looking lamp, I don't have anything in it. That is from HomeSense, is my night light. You can't see it right now, but it changes all different colors. It'll go from purple, blue, yellow, orange, and it'll just like illuminate this area so cutely. I got this at Ikea. I have a frosted gingerbread candle that's burning from Bath and Body Works. Oh, and then I have my iPhone charger just hanging off the side here so that I can just charge my phone while I sleep. And then last but not least is this. And this is a lamp also from HomeSense that is so adorable, has a bow in it. And I thought this really completed this section. Small to medium to tall and it's so cute. Yay. Oh yeah, why don't we just go in these drawers here? Okay, so we kind of have random things in here. Um, a half a piece of gum, I don't know why. A random little earring, I don't know why. I just have to have like a random little drawer I can just throw random stuff in to keep myself organized. But I have a lot of body jewelry in here. And then here's just um, some of Dalton's jewelry that he has and just throws here and I'm like, no, put it away. 
<laughs> then I have Rub A535 back here for sore muscles at night, just easily there. Lip chap, and in here I have scissors, a measuring tape, pencils and pens, because I feel like that's a necessity just to have in your bedside table. This thingy right here I got at HomeSense as well. And in here is not that exciting. I don't even know what I have in here. Oh, this is a Lush. Sore Muscles Tension Massage Bar. I forget which one that is, but it smells like cinnamon and there's massaging beads on there. I also have my Hello Kitty little case that I got, or my boyfriend bought for me actually, in Palm Springs at the street fair. This was actually handmade and hand carved at the Palm Springs street fair. I have like a one of a kind basically, and it's so cute. I store just like some jewelry items in there. Under the bed I have a few storage items. This right here. This has some journals in it, like that. I got this at HomeSense. I have here. It's full of leggings, like this. So yeah, it's a great way to store my leggings. And then I have one right here that have some just lingerie pieces thrown in here, some corsets, um, tube socks, cause they're too like big like this to store in my drawer up here. I just store them here. I have leg warmers, big leg warmers here. Look like a Yeti. And that is it guys. I hope I mentioned everything cause I know I'm gonna get questions on where I got things and stuff like that. And it's not that exciting, but I do enjoy my room. And yeah, I feel like I'm happy with it. It took me a while to um, get colors how I like and bedding how I like. Love it, love it. Yay, one last thing. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the room tour. Like I said, it's not something amazing or high tech or anything like that, but it is my room. And again, I hope you enjoyed and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow with a new video. Bye guys. Today I'm going to be doing a tag video and it is called the 40 beauty questions tag that I've been tagged quite a bit. I heart tagged so much. Yes, I'm Canadian. Tag. <laughs>